That's scene. Don't record it yet. How do we stop recording? Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Joker 511 and Campster 2012. We are doing glitches on transit, so look closely, folks. Oh ho. Sorry about the blurry. Blurriness. Bear's kind of dead, so forgive us. Took us a really long time to get this, so please like if you really like this. First, always try to make this little wind turbine thing. You can open up things for free. And this little piece here, you're supposed to grab that, bring out your turbine, take this out, this out, and it, and then it turns on. And now, folks, this is the hard glitch. This is this is where you put the piece that I just got. You hook, you hook it up on here. You when it's almost about to load, you jump. You jump up and it launches you on here onto the top thing. Look on the bottom. That's where I'm showing you. So yeah. it might work. Half time it doesn't. So half time I'm. Once I was almost up there. Oh, by the way, folks, this is Black Ops 2 zombies that we're showing you. you gotta get to the spot. First, you have to get to the diner. That's where you always want to go because the box is there. Every single time you play transit. Then hold your grenade for three seconds and throw it and it blows all the zombies up behind you. show you another glitch. Bring out your turbine, put it right here, Currency like in the dumpster, in the, no well, in the dumpster, the tire, or like these tires. Right here. And then when the zombies walk on top of this car, they'll keep hitting it, but it doesn't break anything. So you can put whatever you want right here and it'll take them out. So, yeah, so we'll show you later when we have to build something. And all you people who don't know, who's new at this game, uh, there's parts that you build like this. There was gonna be three parts. Look, at, there's gonna be three parts. The car door, on this table or in this bathroom right on this wall now when you get that then when you get that uh door you put it onto here and then or 
PD. And now you have to buy the door in the diner. And then, this piece right here, it would either be here, or here, somewhere over here. And then you put that piece right here. And then, what do I do with it? And then you will have a zombie riot shield when you build that piece. And it's two hits until you, it's two hits until you reach, it's one hit until you reach round 20. Holy crap, dude, I just threw it all the way over there. But one second, I gotta take the turbine. Wait, did you put the turbine? Did you put the turbine over there? Mm hmm Oh, well never mind. I got zombie shield instead. Because I, uh, I know how it sounds like our voices sound like girls. We're not. This is how it just sounds like in videos and other things. So, yeah. Sorry about the girly voices. It's not our fault. It's the camera. And I think if I was like, if we were in a movie and they were doing that stuff, it would be sucky. But they'll probably fix it. Yeah. Okay. All right, and another thing to another of you, uh, new beginners. Beginners. All right, this time don't shoot it off me. All right, I'm showing. You. All right, when you go out and these little monster things come by. When they get on top of your head, you just keep knifing and then try to get back to your, try to get back to the place or like, so 
like a place that doesn't have any dust and crap. And there's another way where they where they cannot get onto your face. When it's running at you, you shoot it up in the air. You just yeah, you just you just shoot it. You just shoot it, and even if it's not insta kill, you just turn around and shoot. It would still take them down. And whenever you see like this gold little box or something that's gold, that's either either something really good or what? A gold box. One second, folks. Yeah. <laughs> oh, box. The golden box for Max Ammo and everything. Oh, yeah, the golden box. Everybody knows that. That was from Black Ops 1. Sorry, folks. This guy, he only, buy, he only bought Black Ops 2. He never played Black Ops 1. But in the other hand, Joker 511 has. So, Camp, Camp sure has it. Alright, now, they're the... Where's the pack? Uh... I'll talk about it. Just tell me where it is. It's. I'll do it, dude. Like, I wanna talk. Come on. Come on. Um, it's in the. It's in the bank. It's under the bank. You gotta do. Um, you gotta put a turbine. It's under the bank. And I'll show you how to do it. Alright, there's another glitch that there's it's not a, a glitch. pack of. There's another thing that wherever you want to find the Pack-a-Punch, it's always underneath the bank, but you have to put a turbine near this one spot. We'll show you that when we get there. Okay? Yeah, the bus. Come on. The bus is not... Oh, do put the ladder on it. Here, I'll show you later. And as you can see, there's a little thing on my friend's... Uh, on my friend's screen. Come on, Cam. Come on, guys. You put, and that is a ladder. All right, you know what? We'll put it on. Put it on later. Hurry up, everybody, get in the bus. All right, and it's a ladder. You put that ladder on the side of the back of the bus. And where you can get on top of the roof. And the piece where you can get on top of the diner, on the roof of the diner, you can put that on the top of the bus. You can put it um, in the lower part of the bus. But I suggest, I suggest if you have a, um, if you have a ladder on the bus already, do not put it on there. Just put it on the diner. But if you don't see the ladder, you can put it on the diner or on the bus. I like to put it on the diner because you can provide the galafal knuckles. And now we're going to teach you how to make a sentry gun on zombies. Yeah. So the sentry, so the ammo thing, you, it's either going to be by this TV right here in the kitchen or on the top of the roof right here on top of the on top of the stairs and then you know how in black ops one where there was all these three teddy bears well here's one the other one's in the bar in town on um on a uh what's it called on a stool or something all right and then the next piece is going to be a lawnmower. It's either going to be here or somewhere over here. So you put that piece right here. My friend got a, um, my friend got a, got the RPD, that's where you put the gun. Alright. The RPD would be... The RPD would be right here. Right, uh... Right here. Now we need a turbine. I so, have one. You have one? No, I don't. Never mind. 
Alright, the thing that I was talking about, if it's not in the bus depot or in the diner, the piece to get on top of the roof or the bus, it would either be in here, which is not. So, that's the information I can give you right now because I don't know where the other place where it be. Where it will be. It would either be just um, bus depot, diner, or in the shed and farm. fridge you can put your gun you can put any gun you want but it has to be like one gun you get to store that gun for as long as you want until you take it out but you can take it back in and that gun stays in there until um you take it out it can be in there for like a year you can put in each game that you play it, it will be in there, but you just gotta get ammo and stuff, and then just put it in the fridge. It will be in there for like, forever. You can play, whenever you play transit, your gun will be in there unless, or when you take it out. And you can put pack-a-punch guns in there, uh, non-pack-a-punch guns. But you can only put in guns. That's it. You can't like put in a cert like uh, a riot shield or anything. Oh, put the turret right there. Yeah, but dude, you need a turbine for it to work. Yeah. We should yeah, and for the sentry guns the that we have, you need a turbine for it to shoot. That's how it was made. I was just gonna. If I made this game, I would just leave it without a turbine. Well, since it like already moves and stuff, I would suggest it would be. Yeah. I would suggest without like a turbine, but you have to have a turbine to start it.
get it since oh I get it now because uh how in, how Richtofen Dempsey and um, I forgot his name Tak Shaka now what we're talking about being dead everybody knows oh and here's another thing you know how I'm just gonna finish my story with the one thing and so they bust here and then the teleporter thing how Dempsey ripped off in and the I'm just gonna call him the Asian guy because I can't pronounce it right. And the Russian, I forgot what his name is again. And uh, and they, you know how they teleport and stuff. If you guys don't, well then look it up. And. Another thing. What? Never shoot or knife the um, the driver of transit too, too many times, or else he will lock you in and you will not be able to get out, and eventually you will die. And uh, if you shoot it, and I feel like Camster said, uh, and it, it like says like stop and stuff, and then. The thing dies, the whole thing blows up, and you gotta at least wait for like a half an hour so it can be back on and then the bus will be up and running. And then, so they teleport and the zombie invasion been happening for a few years now, or more. Or less, who knows, because they teleport to strange places and stuff. Alright. So, you know how I was talking about the... Well, my friend Camster was talking about... Uh, the mystery... I mean, the Packer Punch machine underneath the... Underneath the bank? Well, what you need to do is, like... Is you have to have... You have to have a turbine and one zombie to do this. It can be a crawler or a regular zombie that can run. It doesn't matter. But you have to be, but the zombie has to be away from the turbine because it will break it. And I will show you it when we kill all these zombies.
So all the people who think I was racist, I'm sorry. I did not mean to. I was just... Uh, so, this guy, you know how... Uh, you know how you think that Dr. Max, Dr. 